2022 TV series about Andor. Remember Andor? That guy from that Star War? Well, now he's this guy from this Star War. Just came out yesterday, so I'm not really sure how I feel about it yet. In the first episode, Andor just kind of walks around. I'm interested. Today's math prop appears about 30 minutes into episode 1. It's only on screen for about a second, but it makes an impression. This is a modified Olivetti Summa Prima 20 from the 1960s. In my opinion, the Summa Prima has one of the boldest designs ever for a classic adding machine. The real giveaway is this little round joystick type switch here, which only existed on the Olivetti machines of the 50s and 60s. I have the standard model Summa Prima, which is this wild blue color. Here's a picture of a gray one from John Wolfe's Calculator Museum. This one was made specifically for the UK with two extra buttons to help deal with the British sterling currency. And the prop has those two buttons too, so this must be the British model, which makes sense since the show was filmed in London. Looks like they glued a plate onto the front here and they stuck this weird little Hanoi tower on top to cover up the Olivetti logo. But you can see the stylish ridge on the side. If you look real close, you can see the red undercarriage. The strange top plate is pulled up with the paper spool sticking out the back and the crank handles there on the side. This scene is set on the planet Ferrix. Like most of the Star Wars universe, the place is full of junk. Some of it works, most of it doesn't. Everything's covered with little buttons, switches, wires, steam vents, you name it. Sitting on a table with a bunch of other junk it fits in pretty good, I guess. Nobody uses this thing on screen. She walks in and it looks like she's going to grab it, but then it cuts away and it's out of the show forever. Later on in the episode, we see this thing, which looks like some kind of early electronic calculator. It has the same button arrangement as the TI-1200, but I'm not really an expert on electronics. Maybe somebody else can identify it better. Wait, is that the same thing they stuck on top of the Olivetti? If she knows, she ain't telling. In conclusion, I give Andor my math props rating of good, I guess. I mean, it's not bad. Thanks for watching and let me know if you see any more.